One of the biggest warships in the Norwegian Navy was warned repeatedly it was on a collision course with a Britain-bound oil tanker, before the two vessels smashed into each other, it has been claimed. Crew on board the KNM Helgestad, part of a NATO fleet in the Atlantic, insisted they had control before smashing into Sola in north of Bergen, Norway. The frigate had received alerts from the tanker and from the coastal maritime traffic center but ship management are said to have responded. We are in control in the run-up to the crash. Some 10,000 liters of helicopter fuel from the frigate has leaked into the sea after the collision tore a large hole in its side, the military said. The frigate's 137 crew members were evacuated amid fears that it may sink. The ship which had recently taken part in the vast Trident Juncture NATO military drill in Norway, is strongly listing, Stenzones told a news conference Thursday afternoon. The frigate was lying in the water almost on its side with its stern under the water. The 442 feet long frigate, built in Spain in 2009, is part of a NATO fleet in the Atlantic. The Alliance has been informed of the accident, he said. The Maltese flagged oil tanker, Solar TS, was not damaged and its 23-man crew remained on board. The shipping site Sisla reported the tanker had been loaded with crude oil and was on its way to Britain. Stenzone said the cause of the accident was not clear and the Navy would wait for the findings of Norway's Accident Investigation Board. Earlier reports had said a towboat was also involved in the collision, but Stenzones denied that report. He said the frigate had been pushed by towboats into shallow water where it could not sink fully. We are in a security phase for the time being, he said. He declined to comment on what would happen to the weapons on board the ship.